and welcome back to Caravanning Max. The subject of today's short vlog is in the wardrobe or more accurately what can happen to the contents of your wardrobe as the caravan moves and sways while it's under tow and how you can prevent that happening. This little wardrobe is in the back of our caravan in the washroom and as the caravan's moving along if you're using ordinary hangers what can often happen is that the clothes might slide off the hanger drop onto the floor of the wardrobe and what you end up with is an untidy tangle of clothes. To prevent that happening, lots of YouTubers and ourselves have started to use these textured hangers. They're covered in a sort of velvety material and that helps to stop the clothes sliding off the hanger and dropping onto the floor of the wardrobe as I've described. Now many YouTubers have shown these and talked about them before so I'm not going to go into great detail on these today. But even using these textured hangers you can still get problems. First of all, the hangers can all slide and squash together at one end of the wardrobe, leaving clothes crushed and creased. Or maybe worse, the hangers themselves can fall or jump off the hanging rail and again you end up with a tangled mess of hangers and clothes at the bottom of the wardrobe. We've found a quick and easy fix that can prevent both of these problems and keep your hangers and clothes secure and spaced. Let's go to the lounge area and George can show you how it's done. The things you'll need for this part of the job are a sharp knife, a ruler or a measuring tape of some sort, and some of this stuff. This is pipe protector or pipe insulator. It's very soft, made of foam, very light, easy to cut, available in all the DIY stores such as B&Q and, and, uh, and Wix, but of course other DIY stores are available. You see it has a gap in the centre to fit around the pipe and a slot all the way down the side so it can be easily slid into place. This particular one has a 15mm gap <coughs> excuse me, in the centre to fit our particular wardrobe rail but you'll need to check your wardrobe rail to see which size is going to fit your particular situation. Other sizes are available. The first thing to do is to cut the foam to the correct size for your particular wardrobe rail. I've already done that. Then it then you, all, you, you need to decide how far apart you want your hangers to be. Then it's a simple case of measure that distance and cut a slit. Measure that distance and cut a slit. Measure that distance and cut a slit. Measure and cut a slit. Measure and cut a slit. It's important not to cut too far. You only want to cut far enough so that the hooks on the hangers can slot into place. Once you've measured and cut all your slits, it's an easy job to open up the foam and slide it over your particular wardrobe rail and then you're almost done. We've already got ours cut and the slits put in it and it's in place and in a moment I'll take you back to the wardrobe and show you the final step. You can see from this that we've got our foam already cut to size, the slits are put into it and it's been slotted over our wardrobe rail and the, some of the clothes already put in place. And it's very easy to do that. All you need to do is to locate one of the slits with your fingers, take your hanger hook, slip it into position and then it's held in place. The foam stops the hangers all sliding together so you, your, your clothes end up all creased and it prevents the hangers from jumping off the rail and dumping your clothes into an untidy tangle at the bottom of your wardrobe. A cheap and easy fix to an annoying little problem. Well we hope you found today's video useful and if so you'll give us a thumbs up, a like and share and if you like what you've seen maybe you'll consider subscribing. It's free to do and it really does encourage us. If you have any questions or comments please do contact us in the YouTube way or if you want to use our email, Twitter or Facebook details of those are at the end of the video and we promise to get back to everybody who contacts us. If you want to know when the next video is available just ding on that notifications bell and YouTube should let you know and if you haven't yet watched our other videos please do take a look you might find something that you like there. So in the meantime stay safe, stay healthy Keep calm and caravan on starting next week, yippee!
So for now, it's cheerio from the Max. We'll see you next time. Bye.